What's going on YouTube family? Emperor Mike is back here for another vlog. It's 9.30 and I was, I really wanted to install the intake that I just got, but I, it's kind of late and I'm really tired. So I decided I'm gonna wake up tomorrow morning and then put the intake on, but I just got out of the box. It was slightly used. Uh, thank you so much to Maddie Supra on Instagram for giving me a great deal on this and getting quick shipping on it. So I just wanted to take everyone through it. Um, I'm not gonna do an install video. There's a lot of them out there. It's gonna be sped up, boring, not that detailed, and I honestly don't know what I'm doing yet. I'm gonna use other YouTube videos to help me out, so I'm not gonna bother. So this is a black piece. The intake tube goes there. Something like that. Very exciting stuff. Um, intake filter, cold air intake, but it also came with a turbo inlet pipe, which I'm 99% sure is this piece, which I think this hooks directly up to the turbo. So this piece either you buy separate from the actual intake, or you can buy it all together for $520 on, I think it's speedindustry.com. And then this piece will then bolt. Once everything's on, the intakes, um, like the filter's actually in there, this will then lay like over top here and then bolt down kind of bring it all together to, to make it kind of like a heat shield. After the install is done tomorrow, I will do some revving if there's anything here, and if not, we'll just do some driving clips of it to see what it really sounds like, because every video I've seen sounds ridiculous. Catch you guys tomorrow, peace. All right, YouTube family, I am really upset with myself. I just went out for a drive in the car for the first time since I got the intakes on, and I put it in slow motion, and I'm gonna have to play a clip now to show you guys how ridiculous it is, and it did not do anything for this video. So just, just listen to this shit. I got the intake on. It took a little longer than expected because of me being an idiot, honestly. I did just a couple dumb things. Uh so yeah, that, that, that sums up how my vlogging usually goes. But anyways, listen to these sound clips. I got quite a few from what I could. Just like I said, the first drive out, these were supposed to be part of the other vlog, but it didn't make it, so I restarted it. Anyways, so check these video clips out. sounds absolutely ridiculous so much louder so much better um so hopefully you guys all enjoy it and that gives you guys an idea if it's worth it or not this piece right here this is actually a turbo inlet pipe you see all these holes kind of see it all those holes in it that's what baffles the noise so much whenever the air is coming into the turbo so that is the extra piece again that's called the turbo inlet pipe it's that small piece there um that connects right up to the turbo um, and that's the final piece i had to put on um this is part of the intake sorry i'm kind of like holding it all up this is the obviously the air box and the air box filter this is an aftermarket one i got um it's a drop air filter i forget which brand it was and obviously this just goes on top so i had to rip all that out and then this piece came next and then again down to the turbo inlet pipe this had to come off this definitely broke it retention clip something clip i don't know but the way it's like on there it's really difficult to get off in general and i watched a video and someone just broke it um and i might regret that especially if i go back to stock i'm gonna have to figure that part out but at this point again you guys heard the sound clips now i'm not going back to stock anytime soon at the very least um so i'm not worried about it worst case i just get another from toyota aka bmw i guess i can show you under the hood real quick sadly there's not much to see it's not very crazy aesthetically pleasing at all oh my god it's like doing gymnastics again there's not much to see here so i mean this is all covered this is heat shield there's a heat shield all around the sides i should probably clean this car too and then this is your quarter intake right here and then the next pipe down is, God, it's hot as hell over here. Uh, the next pipe down is the turbo inlet pipe. So that's the update on everything. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. And like I said, sorry, I didn't do an install video. There's no point. There's many videos out there. are gonna be way better than mine, way more clear and everything. 
But um, yeah, MST V2 intake with a turbo inlet pipe, wild, worth every second of dirt and a little bit of blood. Uh, I'll catch up with you all in the next video. Have a great day. If you have any questions or if you want, just like and subscribe to the channel. See you all in the next video. Peace.